Yep, there it goes. Hold, outsider. I bring a message from the king. And what is that? Oh, talk to her. King Kurog <coughs> requests the honor of your presence, outsider. My beloved awaits your arrival at the keep, so do not linger. His dark mood is bad enough without you disappointing him as well. Uh, do you know what the king wants? Of course I know what the king wants. He wants to see you immediately. You know what do I mean. Do you have any other pointless questions you'd like me to answer for you? Yes. What does the king want? <laughs> have I offended you in some way? Ah, uh, outsider. My apologies. The king's mood has set everyone on edge. You could literally cut the tension in the court with a knife. And I fear it will get worse before it gets better. Go. Talk to the king. Perhaps you can raise his low spirits. Okay, I'll go speak to King Karag. Go! Have you no sense of urgency? My beloved's mood has already grown dark. Don't add to his anger as well, outsider. Why is the king so angry? Why? <coughs> Why does the sun rise and fall each day? Why do the spring rains eventually free us from winter's icy grip? The king is angry, and like any force of nature, he refuses to be denied. Okay, but something must have inspired the king, uh, the king's bad mood. Well, yes, of course something did. Go and speak to the king, outsider. I prefer you hear the news from his mouth instead of from mine. Good to know. All right, well, the ki anger of the king. I'm actually going to go complete this really quick since it's actually in the area as well. Yeah. Uh, yeah. this way. I kind of have to, like... Do guesswork. This this city is somewhat confusing to navigate I through. I think. Their work is without compare. All right. Some will say otherwise, but they are wrong. It deliver the scroll. So this is it right here. Hello? Anybody alive in here? Oh, have I been here before? I think I've been here before. Malakath's faithful could use your aid. Eh, maybe later. I do not know you, yet you approach <clears throat> with great purpose. State your intentions and let Malakath judge your worth. Asher said you uh, to give this to you. The sacred words of Malakath. Yes, I heard about the trouble at Farron's stronghold. Thank Malakath that you were able to secure the holy text. The Agra Krun will make sure it remains safe. The Vosh Rock lost today's battle, thanks to you. Okay. Yep. Always a problem. Some of these look really cool. Alright, I don't need that. I don't need any of it, to be honest. Yes. Okay, good to know. So, I am not going to activate that quest. I'm just going to go see the king. I kind of want to focus on the main quests for now. And then we'll... Once I finish all the main stories, I'll come back and start doing side quests but for now wait I don't even need this because I'm already by where I need to be with the great shackle destroyed has the plane mail been stopped let's see that's a cool picture I think hello hi <laughs> have you ever looked at these statues nope I mean really looked at them Legends carved into bronze or stone. The work of hundreds of hours, likely crafted by people who didn't know a thing about their subject matter. And for what purpose do you think? I don't know. But I love his helmet, but something seems off about him ever since the beginning. Uh, something seems off about him, even when he killed that other chief. I'm willing to bet he's the one doing everything. To honor or remember them? And who decides who we honor and remember? Me. The victors, of course, for they get to write the history. But there are two sides to every story. It's true. No one remembers the losers. They fought for what they believed in and failed, and so they are forgotten. What are you getting at? To the vanquished, this isn't a statue of a hero. It's a tribute to a tyrant. Many see me in the same way, a tyrant, forcing my ideas upon the people. They say I'm wrong, that I'll destroy the Orsimer. 
They seek to turn everyone against me. That victimization, that self-victimization that he's at, and that self... He's got an unhealthy sense of pride and accomplishment and advancement. I think it's him. Has someone turned against you? I get reports. Things my advisors think I need to know. One report claims that the Wood Elf is keeping company with Bosrog. When two of my scouts confronted her, she killed them both. I'm concerned that Bosrog has turned Evelie against us. Yeah. Hmm. You think that Evelie Sharp Arrow is a traitor? Evelie aids my enemy. The Wood Elf has chosen the wrong side. I don't. I worry that you might follow her example. But I have a moot to prepare for, and I've said what I had to say. When you see Evely, I expect you to do the right thing. Sorry, bro, but I like Evely a lot. I highly doubt she's a freaking traitor, and you seem shady anyways. So... there's that. Just saying, bro. Just saying. Yes, I'm sure you are. I have a message for you. From who? I thought that was you when I saw you enter the keep. You were in there so long, though, I was beginning to think you'd never come back out. <laughs> it's scary, isn't it? Malak out this and Trinamak that and all that talk about traitors in the court. You said you had a message, though? Right, right. Uh, a little wood elf gave it to me. Described you to a turn and asked me to deliver this letter. Not sure why she was hiding under that hood, and why she spoke with a funny accent. But I haven't met that many Wood Elves, so... Uh... Did this Wood Elf say anything else? As a matter of fact, although it didn't make a lick of sense to me, she said the letter itself wasn't important. She said that what really matters is the beginning of every thought. Maybe you'll understand it, because I certainly don't. Goodbye. Read the letter in your inventory. So it's gotta be under quest items. Yeah, the Wood Elf's message. Uh, ask... Okay, let me see. Should we read this? I'm a horrible reader, but... We love you, little something. Uh... What is you know, he? Uh, come to think of it, maybe the message is in some kind of code. Hey, may maybe someone in the Mages Guild could help you decipher that. I mean, if you need any help, that is. Do you know anyone who can decipher codes? <coughs> maybe, if there's actually a hidden message and it's not just some weird poem. I have a friend, sort of. Name's Kalina. She just arrived in the Mages Guild and she's the smartest person I know. She could help you, probably. Okay, I guess we gotta find Kalina. Decipher the letter, hint, seek, help to decipher the code. So, there has to be a mages guild here, right? Right there. Let's go ahead and drop that there. And head to the mages guild. Because we're definitely gonna need help deciphering it. It's a big location, and I don't wanna read that. Because it's gonna be a pain in my behind. The Nords are rude. Shut the up. Oh, Which one's the Mages Guild? It's around here somewhere. This is a shared building, it looks like. With some stores. Well, imagination are the only magical powers that everyone possesses. If, if you great nose, consider yourself a magician. If you say so, Bastion. Oh, hello. This weather. It's fit for orcs and nords, of course, but it does terrible things to my skin. Ah, well. Life in the Mages Guild and all that, I suppose. Still, I continue to petition for a post in Mournhold. Maybe one day. Well, hello, fellow Dark Elf. I was told that perhaps you could help decipher a coded message? A coded message? <clears throat> mm hmm You mean as in spies and such? That's not something I'm usually asked about. Reagents, soul gems, spells. Those are my usual areas of expertise. 
Not sure I can be of much help in this, but perhaps I can offer a bit of advice. Anything that could help with uh, would be appreciated. Coded messages, if that's what this is, tend to contain patterns. The message, or the poem in this case, usually doesn't mean anything as a whole. The real message is in the tiny snippets. Try looking at the words differently. Maybe that will help. There must be something else you could tell me. A bribe? Oh, very well. I accept that you didn't hear this from me. There's an outlaw den below the city. It's the best place to find all kinds of unsavory characters. If anyone can decipher your message, you'll find them there. Okay. I hate that I had to pay for it, but hey, whatever works, I suppose. Haha. -ha. Where is Oh, it's on the opposite side of the city. We're going to be have we're going to have to go back and forth for this quest, I swear. It's okay though. We got this. If I can raise a little gold, I'm on the next character. How do I get in there? It's literally in an obvious place. Everyone could see them coming in and out of this place. Could you not be more obvious? Okay. There's a quest that way, but I I'm gonna follow this for now. Hello. Listen, this one is completely innocent. Do orcs all Khajiit look the same, yes? And I was not in the city earlier today. I was especially nowhere near the marketplace. This one is not the one you are looking for. Yeah, I don't care what you stole, first of all. Second of all, I'm looking for help decoding a message. Codes and languages. <laughs> This one considers those to be her specialty. You have come to the correct person, my friend. Let me see the message. I will even give you a discount since I was not arrested today. <laughs> I was told uh, that the poem isn't important. What matters is the beginning of every thought. Interesting, but extremely obvious. You really needed this one's help to decipher this? There are not even any mysterious symbols or complex patterns. It's so simple a sober Nord could figure it out. <laughs> well, rude. No offense intended. Well, tell me what it says then, rude. No, no. <coughs> if this one simply blurts out the answer, then you will have learned nothing. Better to teach you to hunt than hand you a sandwich, yes? I want the sandwich. Of each thought. Look at the first word of every sentence. Then all will become clear. I hate you so much. I guess I'm gonna have to read this stupid message. We are at the inn. Hidden room secret words. Orcs don't smell. <laughs> oh god, that's actually pretty funny. What is this quest though? I'm I'm gonna follow it exactly I'm gonna follow the quest exactly where it wants me to go. I'm tempted. I was tempted to go click on that, but I'll wait. I'm gonna follow the quest. It'll, if it's a part of this quest line, it's going to uh, lead me there. There's two inns, though. It's probably not there. It's probably at that one. So let's go to that one. If I have to assume, because the other one is where the king likes to hang out. Oh, actually, you know what? It's gotta be here. Because of the king. <clears throat> Hidden room, though. Hidden room. Where would a freaking hidden room be? Okay. Because this is where... Oh, wait, no. It's the chieftain. So it would be the other. Oh, well, that's where the quest is. 
Why didn't I think about that? Oh, whatever. Yeah, it's because it wouldn't be at that one because that's the king's place and I totally mixed them both up. It's the king that we're trying to avoid because we have the chieftain. The greedy gut. I have a greedy gut myself there, bruh. So the hidden passage is orcs don't smell. Is it upstairs? Yeah, it is. <clears throat> hey, hello. Damn moot. First the king invites outsiders, and now this. It's no wonder we don't have any rooms left to rent. Plenty to eat and drink downstairs, though, so feel free to go and bother the bartender. No, relax. You got the wrong impression. I'm actually looking for my friends. A wood elf and a couple of orcs? A wood elf and two orcs? Sounds like the beginning of a bad limerick. Sorry. We don't see that many of the little elves around here, so I really can't help you. I understand. Orcs don't smell. Or so I've heard. Ah, uh, my apologies. I couldn't reveal anything until you said the proper words. Take the stairs down into the storage area. Look for an opening in the wall. It leads to our most private set of rooms. Good to know, thank you. I like how we did... How has nobody discovered this secret place? It's a gigantic freaking hole in the wall. We can't just walk into the Voshrock base. That's suicide. We have to find out what the Voshrock have planned. If we wait for them to strike, it will be too late. Whatever they're planning, it's going to happen soon. They just about told me as much when they threw me into my own prison. Maybe we should have left you in there. For all we know, you deserve to be in prison. Listen to me, Elf. I didn't attack anyone. I left Orsinium and they ambushed me. I sent you to rescue the Chief Everly. I wouldn't have done that if I believed he was guilty. You lied to us, High Priestess. You knew who you were sending us to rescue the entire time. This feels like one giant trap, and we walked right into it. It does a little. Everly's mad. He found us. I'm sorry that Everly is upset, but I did what had to be done. Please, let's talk. We have two orcs, a high elf, an imperial. I'm a dark elf and a wood elf with Everly. I know you have questions, and you're probably just as angry with me as Everly. But please, hear me out, I beg you. There are deadly plots unfolding, and we're all in terrible danger. But you knew we were rescuing Barzog? Uh, Basrog? You, you definitely lied to us. I withheld certain details, yes. But I had good reasons. If cultists killed Basrog in Trinamak's name, it would have started a civil war. And if Kurog found out you were trying to rescue Basrog, you would never have been allowed to leave the city. I mean, if it was a secret mission, you could have just made it obvious that his name would have been a secret. I don't know. Still seems a little shady. I don't understand. You said Basrog was behind the attacks on the temple. Basrog's shield wife approached me after the Voshrak attacked Baron's stronghold. She knew the king would do nothing for those who didn't accept his rule. Chief Basrog was ambushed at the same time the temple was being attacked. And what does that prove? Well, it proves that he had no time to ta to to plan. Someone wanted to blame Basrog for the Malakath fanatics, exactly. while also removing the chief from the battlefield. It was a brilliant plan. Fortunately, you were able to foil it. And now, thanks to Basrog, we know what the Voshrak are planning next. And what are the Voshrak uh, planning to do next? The Voshrak want to make a statement, something big. Basrog thinks it involves the moot, where all the chiefs will be gathered. We need more information. Someone needs to enter the old Trinamak temple to the <coughs> west and learn more about their plans. And that someone is me, right? I'll send scouts ahead, but you'll need to get inside and do whatever it takes to uncover the exact nature of their plan. Lives are at stake, remember that. Now please, talk to Everly. We need her. You have to convince her to help us. I agree. You two have your orders. Scout the temple exterior. The others will join you shortly. Finally! Something to do that doesn't involve a message. Oh, I forgot about the Argonian. We have an Argonian too. So she's upstairs, of course, because we saw her go up. Evely, is this your room? I hate this situation. I really do. Being a hero, 
That's supposed to be pure and honest. Good is good and evil is evil, you know what I mean? But nothing here is clear cut. I can't tell the good guys from the bad. If it was easy, everyone would be a hero. I'm not even sure whose side I'm on anymore. When Barzrog and I sneaked into the city, two guards got lucky and happened to be in the right place at the right time. They attacked. I... I... I just reacted and let my arrows fly. Uh, you defended yourself and your... And your charge. Yeah, I'm gonna say that. I killed two guards who were just doing their job. They probably have loved ones, pets. I... I don't know if I can do this anymore. Aw, Emily. You have to do what's right for you. But I could certainly use your help. That much is for sure. I knew you were going to say that. <laughs> Still, I'm not sure I can get past Solgra's lies. She tricked us into helping Chief Basrog. And I'm still not sure about his role in all this. All right. You can count on me. But I'm doing this for you, not them. Well, thank you. I appreciate that. Come to Paragon's rem Remembrance. I need someone I can trust with us. I mean, after all, we literally only have each other. Everyone around us is lying about something. <clears throat> I can do that. Besides, it'll be nice to get out of the city. Try to forget about the price on my head for a while. All right, let's do this. But be careful out there, will you? I can't afford to lose the only person I really trust. Agreed. Okay. Too easy. Uh... There's an actual door. This... Is a secret room? There's nothing secret about this. Oh my god, that was ridiculous. So ridiculous. How far are we going anyways? Ridiculous. I might as well fast travel here. It'll be the fastest way there. Super ridiculous. Oh, it's this way. I almost went the wrong way. Come on, Bastion, catch up. Well, that's death. I I think it might be up here anyways. Whoa. Hold up. Oh, actually, it's below. There's no way I'm going. I definitely wanted to jump, but okay. Good job, game. There is... Oh, there's no way I'm getting that right now. Run! Yeah. Hey, at least I didn't die. Now we gotta... It feels like it's a long way to go just because we have to go down, scale down a gigantic mountain. That certainly spells death if I decide to jump down. Hey, haven't we been here before? No. No, we haven't. Okay, we got a way shrine I need to activate. The quest is right here, though, too. So we're actually kind of golden. Uh-oh. That was close. Nice. Hey, it's Evely. has to be somewhere in those hills. Is it Argonian? It is. certainly well hidden. If Buzzrug lied to us, then we're probably about to meet with horrible, horrible deaths. The Argonian, uh, Bastion's inside the Argonian. I've got good news, disappointing news, and downright awful news. The good, Barzrog's instructions were easy to follow. The disappointing, I have no idea how to find the entrance, and there's no way to get inside without being attacked once we do. So what's the downright awful news? I lost a bet with Talvia, and now I owe him a traditional Valenwood dinner. You know, the kind wood elves like to eat. I can't wait to see the look on his face when he realizes what kind of meat he's eating. It'll be priceless. They're cannibals. That's so wrong. 
Uh, well, you sound like your old self again. Yeah, I guess I just needed to get out of the city. I was seriously depressed when I wound up on the king's most wanted list. Thanks for pushing me. Infiltrating a cult is certainly better than hiding in a hole someplace. Uh, so how do we get inside? Well, with all the runners we spotted, we know we're in the right place. We just need to find a way to get inside without being noticed. You know, we might be able to do something with those higher ranking cultists in the fancy mask. A disguise is a good idea. Seen any of the cultists recently? Well, a few of the mask cultists passed this way a little while ago. Then we heard a large commotion over there to the west. I can't be sure, mind you, but I think those Vosh Rock might have... Well, they could have walked into an... Um... Just tell me what happened. Toby thinks... Well, <laughs> he thinks that the group might have walked into an Achartair mating ritual. The sounds from the west, the screams. If we throw, the noise was horrible. Then it got <clears throat> real quiet. I don't think it went well for the cultists. Well, that's weird. But I'll go see if I can find what, uh, something we can use. Just don't get too close to those Achartes. I hear they become extremely violent when anything interrupts their frolicking. Gross. We'll look around on our own and meet you inside. Good luck. Okay, yeah, I guess I'll do this. It's, that's, uh, that's amazing. So those are bad guys. Let's go around. Now bring it around town. These are the mate. The mates. Well, I don't have a choice. Oh. Block. Ow. Very nice. And just like that. Oh, dude, we look so cool. Yeah, we look dope. Do I have I discovered that ring? I haven't. I didn't think I did. Let's get rid of that. And whatever we just picked up. And now the ring. Seeing as I don't need it. Where's the way? Oh, okay, we're going the right way now. I was confused for a second. Hey. Who are you? I don't know whether to stay here or go find help. If they hurt my Shalda, I don't know what I'll do. Wait, hold up. What happened here? Shaldagon and I were on our way to Arsinium, accompanying other artisans answering the king's call. We were attacked by some sort of cult. The Vash Rock, they called themselves. I managed to escape, but my Shalda's still somewhere in those ruins. Cultists? Uh, what were they after? I don't know. They weren't exactly explaining themselves as they went along. Their leader called himself Glothan the Recruiter. He said we'd all be true believers in no time. I'm afraid he's going to hurt Shalda and the others. I feel so helpless. Yeah, I could try to find your friends. Thank you so much for helping me. With your help, I just know that Shalda and I will be back together in no time. Can you tell me anything else about your attackers? There were a lot of them. And they were strong. Stronger than we were, at any rate. Glothan was the worst. He kept saying that fire and ice would lead us to Trinimax truth. Whatever that is. Will you find Shalda and the others? Yeah, well, Please. for sure, dude. Just tell me about Shalda and the others. Shalda and I packed up our pottery shop in Shornhelm to make a new start in Orsinium. If I lose her, I don't know what I'll do. The others, just travelers we met along the way. A cook, a couple of mages. I hate to think of them coming to harm. Yeah, well, wait here. I'll search the ruins and see what's going on. I, I appreciate your help. Shalda and I aren't very religious, but what these cultists are doing is wrong. 
The, oh, and I noticed an opening in the back of the ruins. Good to know. That might be the best way to escape after you find Shalda and the others. Well, before you do though, give uh, let me know a little bit of information about uh, what's, what did you call him, Glotham the Recruiter? Glothan's a brutish, nasty orc. Praised Trinimac with one hand and slew a poor tailor who defied him with the other. He took notes, made a list of the captives, his new recruits, he called them. That should help you locate Shalda and the others. Good to know. I'll see what I can do. Oh, they're friendly because I'm dressed like them. Good to know. Except I need to avoid people with torches. Or anything that's gonna get me discovered, really. Well, that picture actually tells me a lot. Wait, who's this? You're late. The others have already gone inside. Get a move on. Well, that's the quest. Let me see the map. Yeah, so the main quest is that way. I'm actually gonna go trigger this really fast. What was that? This illusion is so weird. It looks like I'm wearing robes, but I feel so unencumbered. This is like the time I licked one of our great hists. You're so exposed. It's merely an illusion bound to the amulet. Nothing to be concerned about. I've seen these used at festivals and grand balls back home. I wonder if they come in different colors. First of all, this Argonian was at one point on drugs, and she is a freak. Looks like you found an amulet too. But tell me, was I right? Did the Achartes get all frolicsome on those cultists? Hmm. That's Wait so gross. Moment. Your amulet's cracked. You weren't supposed to break it, you know. It was broken when I found it. The Enchantres, uh, weren't particularly careful with the cultist. Well, the illusion seems to be holding up, at least for now. Hopefully it won't fail at a particularly critical moment. Heh, <laughs> foreshadowing. Anyway, I think we should split up and cover more ground. That's the best way to find what we're looking for quickly. Uh, are you sure splitting the party's a good idea? This place is enormous. Besides, you never put all your acorns in one basket. We need to find out what the Voshrak are up to and fast. Flies and I will look around out here while you and Tal see what the high-ranking cultists are meeting about. Yeah, let's rendezvous back uh, here after we find something. Good idea. <clears throat> let's not take too long. Lives are depending on us. And speaking of lives, make sure Tal stays safe, will you? He isn't as experienced as we are. I'm afraid his wide-eyed enthusiasm is going to get him injured. Isn't that like uh, the leaf calling the tree green? Ha ha. Tease me all you want, but I know better now. Sort of. As long as you're here, though, I know you'll watch out for us. I will. You're surprisingly good at that sort of thing. I... I kind of am, thank Stay you. Stay safe. Flies and I will meet up with you later. I guess we're really doing this, aren't we? Yes. All right. We can do this. We just sneak in, find out what we need to know, and get out. I mean, it's just a meeting. We have these amulets. We'll be fine. Right? You sure you're ready for this? It's the whole reason I came to Rothgar. To show that I can fight. To prove myself, to my family, to everyone. I'm more than just a scribe destined to spend his whole life behind a desk. This, this will show everyone what I'm capable of. You don't have to prove anything, but I already believe that you're a brave person. Just for the record. Oh, that's where you're wrong, my friend. I come from a long line of warriors and mages, but most of my family considers me to be the tarnished fruit on the tree of golden pears. That's messed up. It's time for me to show them who I really am. Then let's go do something to make your family proud. I knew you'd understand. When your father is a royal mage, your mother is one of the Queen's Guard, and your sister almost single-handedly won the Battle of Sunken Spire. Well, let's just say, I've got a lot to live up to. Now, let's go do this. Let's go. But first, 
I want to locate the travelers. The main quest does say to go that way, but I think everybody's probably gonna be around here, potentially. So, let's see if we can find these guys. Knock out... Uh-oh. Sit down! Why am I getting... My thing is... Uh-oh. It almost sounded for a second that she was like, For the Brotherhood. But that's the wrong game. I've been playing a lot of Fallout 76 recently. And yes, I like that game a lot. Join us or die. It's that simple. Hey, over here! Who are you? He killed him! Me. That was easy. That guy was a joke. Yeah, you guys can read this if you guys want. Right, let me restart over. Yep, just go ahead and push pause if you guys want to read this. And good. There you are. Hello. They kept threatening me. Said they were going to throw me in the ice prison. What should I do now? The hell's an ice prison? Thanks, but what should I do now? I'm not really good at making difficult decisions. Can you make uh, can you make your way uh, to the back of the ruins? I think <laughs> I can do that as long as I'm careful. Others were dragged in here with me, humble travelers who never harmed anyone, and now they're threatened with pain and death if they don't swear allegiance to the Bosch Rock. I'll find the others. We'll meet up ba at the back of the ruins. Right, right. Thanks again. You know, I came to Rothgar because it was supposed to be a safe and amazing place for orcs to live. Well, so far, it doesn't seem to be either safe or amazing. Goodbye. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna do this quest. I might as well since I'm already here. Kill two birds with one stone, you know. Help me, please. This fire, can you put it out? Yep. There's some water over by the wall. I conveniently found a bucket of water. And just like that. You are safe. One bucket of water. Ow, 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 damn, those are hot. Yeah, I would have jumped over that, just saying. Now I know what roast horker feels like. <laughs> they kept stoking the fire, making it hotter and hotter. I was almost ready to agree to whatever they wanted. Almost. Uh well Rasha sent me to rescue. Rasha's alive? <clears throat> Praise the eight and anyone else who wants to listen. I'm just glad she didn't follow us in here herself. Those Voshrock maniacs want new members. Someone who calls herself the proselytizer leads this bunch. Uh-oh. You need to stop her. That's not a very effective way to proselytize. Osnara the proselytizer? She's a horror. She came by not too long ago and told them to make the fire hotter. Said it would help me see the light. If I get the chance, I'll show her some light. Uh, I'd rather have you get escape with your life intact. Go to the back of the ruins. We'll meet you, uh, we'll meet there after the proselytizer's dealt with. Do we get to take out the you proselytizer? Don't have to tell me twice. There's two of them. Okay. Find the other captives. There's two more on the map. One. So two. I'm assuming that the last one is with the proselytizer. I'm almost certain that's the case. If I can avoid fighting, I will. Here you go, I'll help out there, bud. Anybody here? Don't touch anything. Oh, there's two Don't here. Touch the switches. They're trapped. What do you mean trapped? Trapped, you know. Touch the wrong switch and somebody dies? Oh. Kind of trapped. The Vosh Rock took us captive. Said we were gonna join their cult one way or another. If I stay in this icy prison long enough, I might just agree to anything. How do I set you free? That's the problem. If you push the switch in front of me, Gahar will be released, but I'll freeze to death. If you push the switch in front of him, I go free and he dies. Can't I rescue both? Whoops. Not this time. 
The Voshrock set this up so that only one of us would get to join their crazy cult. If I were noble, I'd say save Gahar and let me die. But I'm not noble. I have a family. They need me. And I'm a healer. I can help you if you let me. So I should save you instead of Ga Gra whatever? Gahar seems to be a good sort. But do we really need another violent battle mage? I heal the sick and help the wounded. And more than that, I want to live. I know it must sound terrible, but I really want to live. Oh my god, this is horrible. They're going to make me choose between them two. Don't touch the switches or you'll kill us. Uh, what are you doing? Uh, yeah. The Vashrock. They're trying to break us. They want Unsulag and me to swear to serve Trinimac. Or their version of Trinimac, at least. So far, we've refused. But these ice prisons wear you down. But what's the point of all this? They said they only need one of us. The switch in front of me releases on Sulak, but freezes me. And the one in front of her does the reverse. They keep coming in and asking us which switch to press. So far, we refuse to play their game. So far. So there's no way I can save you both? If I knew how to do that, I'd tell you. I hate to say this, but I don't want to die. If you free me, I can help. I'm a strong elemental mage and I can fight. But this blasted prison keeps me from casting even the simplest spell of warming. So I should save you instead of Ush Unsulag. Unsulag's a good woman, but she's already lived a full life. I can aid the rulers of Arsinium, assist my people. I have many productive years remaining if I get out of this. Release me and I'll devote myself to helping others. You have my word. Oh, such a tough decision. Young and potential? Or good-hearted, but elderly? Oh my god, my heart, dude. I'm so sorry to whoever I choose. Alright, I'm gonna do it like this. Eeny meeny miny mo, catch a tiger by the toe. If he hollers, let him know. Eeny meeny miny mo. Oh, I'm sorry, you're dead. You're dead. You're gonna die. What a terrible choice you had to make. But Trinimac preserved me. Thank you no. for choosing oh, me. Oh no! Oh, it was a trick. I hate the cold. I'm sorry. Horrible, but you made the right choice. You'll see. I thought it was the opposite, so it was a trick. <clears throat> I feel terrible about what happened to Gahar, but I'm as good as my word. I'll fight alongside you until we get out of this madhouse. All right, let's deal with these cultists and get out of here. Of course, my healing magic is yours to command. I won't let you down. Good. I don't need a healer though. I wish I could just tell you to leave. Haha! -ha. Where is she at? She better stay close. I really don't want her to die. About damn time! Ancient ruins full of cultists makes my knees hurt. How did you get past the others? Out of my way, youngster. I can find my own. Sit your butt down. Uh. Easy enough. So what's the deal now? Eliminate. Where's the Where's the proselyte? Okay, so I gotta go back again. I feel horrible about the dude that we got that we killed. And he's, he magically disappeared. Whoop. Ha ha! Okay, so now I go right. It's literally, literally right around the corner. Stay close, lady. I know you're elderly, but you gotta stay close to me. Oh, of course. Oh, 
That's not what I wanted to hit. I didn't even know that thing was there. Ten converts this week alone. But fire is better. I've got it fifteen. Whoops. Haha. -ha. That was easy enough. Man, we we didn't save everyone. That's kind of heartbreaking. Someone claim to worship a god and go on about killing someone who doesn't agree. We got three out of the five, unfortunately. Go ahead. We'll be right behind you. Yes, we just have to be careful about it. No worries. We'll stay back and let you deal with any of those Boshrock maniacs we run into. We'll move forward as soon as we see that the coast is clear. All right, follow me. Uh, after at the top of the stairs. Right, let's go. Sit your butt down. The day is ours. Let me just kill everybody. And done skis. Oh, there's still a couple left. Hiya! Whoops, wrong button. This mechanic is so cool. Dunzo. Is that everybody? No, we still got a little bit more going to do. Then we're gonna have to turn around and go back and potentially kill everyone again. Oh, switch weapons. Ow. They get up. I know, I know. Bastion, take care of my lightweight, please. That's it. Are you hurt? Nope. Can't even touch me, bro. Too easy. Just in case. This should be it. How far down do we have to go? I almost didn't see her actually. What did they hit me with? This has to be the final room, right? No remorse. Oh, hello. Man, we are destroying these guys. These guys literally don't stand a chance. Kind of feel sorry for them. Not really. Talk to uh Where's she at? Oh. Hurry up! I need to talk to you so I can go back and complete the main story. But I feel good that we saved these guys. I feel horrible for the guy we had to kill though. Oh, we had to leave. I guess that kind of makes sense, huh? Am I able to get back in there if I just turn around? I hope so. Oh my god. We're down here! I'm gonna have to go all the way back around. You did it. I don't know how you did it, but I'm eternally grateful for what you've done. I did it by killing people. It's what I do. You must be relieved uh, to see Shaldron again. I know you did your best, and I'm ever so grateful. We're going to stick together and find the nearest stronghold. We'll hire some bodyguards and make our way to Orsinium. We won't forget what you did for us. None of us will. Okay. Yep, figured. Let's grab anything at all. Sure. Thank you, thank you. Now I gotta go back inside. <laughs> the good thing is that the main quest is just to the right of the main entrance, so we really didn't go too far out of the way. 
So that's the good thing. We just have to go through another, an extra loading screen, unfortunately. Yeah, this tells me a lot. Trinomac versus the King. The Trinomac are the good guys in this situation. And the King seems to be the bad one. I'm almost certain that's the case, dude. This is actually a really cool loading screen picture. I like it a lot, actually. Okay. I'm coming. Ooh, what's going on here? Trinimac, hear our prayer. Guide our weapons and alert us to all dangers. Grant us the courage to complete the trial you placed before us. That doesn't sound good. I thought we were just spying on a meeting. You, the Chosen of the Vashrak, have shown bravery against the Malakath heretics. Even going so far as to invade the temple we love and cherish. But one challenge remains. A challenge to test you, to select the most worthy for our most important mission. Okay, I guess we gotta complete a challenge of some sort. You! You stand among the holy words of Trinimac. Read the scrolls carefully and choose a blessing to help you in the coming trial. Well, what can you tell me about the trial? The mission before us requires the best the Vashrak has to offer. This trial will determine those select few through a test of wits, speed, and strength. Trinimac himself will winnow the iron from the ore. Uh, this mission. I'm not sure I know the, all the details. Oh, the details are the purview of those who complete the mission. But Trinimac thanks you for volunteering, no matter how things turn out. If you succeed and do as the Council demands, all will be revealed. Fail, and death is your only reward. That doesn't sound fun. As the Council demands? The last part of the trial requires that you obey the Council without question, but you won't have to deal with that until the very end. Remember, if you succeed, you will be named a Chosen of Trinimac and allowed to partake in the sacred mission. How are our rituals different from the ones celebrated in Arsinium? That's a strange question for someone who holds your rank. Haven't you learned this much already? I just want to understand, I, uh, I just want to make sure I understand the, our tenets before I proceed. The temple's leaders are too forgiving. They live in harmony with non-believers. Trinimac is a god of war. He does not tolerate Kratos? gods such as Malakath. Soon it won't matter, though. We have agents at work within the city, even as we speak. Agents in the city? Patience, Overseer. All will be revealed in good time. First, complete the trials and prove your worth in this endeavor. Then, all will be revealed. And if you fail, it won't matter. For the dead have little use for knowledge. Well. Hey, what's up, buddy? I don't think this is just some routine meeting. What in Akatosh's name are they talking about? A trial? Trinamax's blessing? Sounds kind of dangerous to me. I think we need to complete the trial to find out what they're planning. My father always says... The rabble face death every day, while the brave always find a way to defeat it. I've never been exactly sure what he meant, but I think I know now. You don't have to do this if you don't want to, my friend. Yes. Yes, I do. This is what I came here for. This is my time to shine. He's a brave man. Besides, you're here with me. We'll watch each other's back and come out victorious in the end. Good to know. Uh, I don't know what I'm reading. I guess I'll read them all real quick. If you guys want to read, push pause. As I always say, if I read it, it'll take all day. Hello. Have you studied the scrolls? No. Do you know the words of Trinimac and are you ready to enter the gauntlet? No, the but I'm going. The only need you will receive is the blessing that you choose, so make your selection wisely. I've studied the words of Trinimac. So, which blessing have you decided upon? Will you accept the blessing of Avalian and become one with the wind? Or will Vaya's resolve protect you from the coming trial? 
Or perhaps Usanok's rage will grant you the strength to succeed. Maybe speed? Protection? Let's go with... Let's go with... Let's go with protection. Then let Trinimac be your shield against the dangers of the gauntlet. Okay, I hope I didn't mess that up. I probably did. You. Listen well, for I do not like to repeat myself. <laughs> Unlock the door, you need to activate the four switches. The Vosh rock inside will try to stop you. You will be timed. Sounds easy enough. If you take too long, the switches reset and you will need to begin again. Others may pass you and take the position you fight for. And don't worry about killing anyone. They're certainly going to try to kill you. I can kill other Vosh rock? Trinimac favors the victorious in battle. If followers fall, they are not worthy. The Voshrock understand that. So should you. I'm ready. Your time starts now. This sounds ridiculously stupid. How do they keep new members? Get them, Bastion. Oh, wrong one. Stop it. Where am I going? I couldn't hit him. I'm gonna die. Okay. I have to kill these guys. Hurry up. Hit him. Oh god, they're everywhere! How do I do this? The good thing is that... Okay, it's going... Kind of well, I guess. Oh, wrong one! OMG. Maybe if I hide here? What am I missing? The one on the far side. Oh, this is... Legit a little bit more complicated than I expected. I should have took speed. That sounds horrible, by the way. I did it. Wait, how do I get up there? Stop it. Run. Don't die. I guess protection kind of did help, it was though. Tough, but we made it. I knew we could do it. Good job, my friend. I actually almost died a couple times. Oh, snap. You did great back there. I have to say, I'm impressed. Uh, just give me a moment to catch my breath. It might be an illusion, but I'm sweating like an orc under here. I mean, at least we both survived, my friend. We did, didn't we? We did. I'm pretty sure that was because the Voshrak were busy trying to deal with you. I'm beginning <laughs> to understand why Everly admires you so much. Because I'm a shield? <laughs> I suppose we uh, have to go in, uh, in there next. The council, right. I wonder <laughs> what they're going to ask us to do as our final test. Whatever it is, we can't hesitate. Lives are depending on us. We need to find out as much as we can about this sacred mission they keep going on and on about. Okay, sacred mission. Wonder what this is. Can't believe we did that test though. Show 
Why would I do that? My amulet stopped working. And did they just say something about spilling my blood? I'm not gonna oh spill my. your blood, buddy. You're not considering following through with this, are you? No. That's... That's insane! That's not gonna happen. excessive. <laughs> Let's go. Not gonna happen. He's my friend. I don't betray my friends. That was kind of exciting. That's got it. I'll walk the door while you search the room. Find out what they're planning. Then go and let the others know. Will do. Good job, my friend. You held yourself up very well. Boss Rock orders. Uh, good to know. I don't know what that says. You guys can push pause as always. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Someone's gonna literally bring it up, bring it up in conversation afterwards. So I'm not worried about what it says because they're just gonna tell me what it says. Oh, hello. Nice of you to join me. Where's the other guy? Dude, he hit Bastion hardcore. Sit your butt down. Leave Bastion alone. Bastion farted on him, dude. What a shame. You missed. Wait, where'd he go? If I don't have to kill him, I'm not going to. These, however... They're just asking for it. I guess I didn't have to do all that. Too easy. <coughs> I still got the blessing, too. How long do I keep the blessing for? The blessing is just a damage shield, which actually is... It really did come in clutch. The speed would have been nice too, though. Hello. There you are. I was beginning to get worried about you. We've found out some... Where's Talvia? Talvia's fine. He's keeping the Vosh Rock busy so we can go warn the city. All by himself? Are you sure he can handle that? What am I saying? Of course you're sure. We managed to find out that the attack on the temple was a ruse perpetrated by the Bosch Rock. That was right before our amulet stopped working. Uh, we lost our amulets too, so it's not just you. Yeah, I was suddenly as naked as an ash tree that had <laughs> lost its last leaf of the season. Good thing we stashed our gear nearby. Anyway, the temple attack was all to place the blame on Basrog. The chief is innocent. I didn't help a murderer. Good. I learned that the Vashrock are, are hiding in the city. They're going to attack the chiefs uh, at the moot. That's something. But not enough to provide the edge we were hoping for. It's pretty important we information. You have to be careful. Anyone could be working with the Vashrock. I don't know about you, <clears throat> but all this intrigue is starting to make my head hurt. Return to Orsinium and warn Chief Vashrock. I'll meet you there shortly. Lies and I will go warn Chief Basrog. This whole thing? It's stranger even than any Investigator Vale story I've ever read. <clears throat> Here, take this. I found it and thought you should have it. A protecting towel. I appreciate that. Good. The good thing is that 
we managed to keep all of our friends alive. So now we basically go back to use the light of Meridia. Oh, that's. I guess I'll go. I'll just fast travel back to Orsinium. And then that way we can progress with the main story. We got some very important information out of all of this, though. And it's crazy how she was butt naked. Why wasn't I naked? Not that I wanted to, but you know you what I mean. can't lock us out of our inn. That's tyrannical. You should have thought about that before you helped the enemies of our king. Now get out of my way before I toss you in a cell, too. What was that about? Let's talk to her and see what that was all about.